In 1918, as World War I was coming to an end, women made a huge change and broke down the barriers and joined the United States Marine Corps. The Corps wasn't the only one making changes as America jumped into the Roaring Twenties, an age of dramatic social and political change. Massive change was happening all around, and the Marine Corps was no exception. This is the Marine Corps through the decades. The 1920s, a time of jazz music, the Charleston, Foxtrot, the Prohibition, and a time you could get a new car for 260 bucks. The 20s were a major time in history for the new woman movement. Women earned the right to vote when the 19th Amendment was passed. They began working in white collar jobs, had increased availability for birth control. As both society and the Marines were undergoing massive change, many women enlisted in the Marine Corps Reserves in 1918, including Ofa Mae Johnson, who was the first known woman to enlist. Prior to her enlistment, she worked as a civil service employee at the headquarters of the Marines, where she received an assignment to be a clerk in the office of a quartermaster general. Sadly, their service was short-lived after World War I came to a close, because on July 15, 1919, the Marine Corps issued an order for women reservists and those on clerical duty to be moved to inactive status. Even though it was military office work and short-lived, Johnson broke down the barriers for generations of future Marines to come. Woman suffrage is a long story of hard work and heartache, crowned by victory. 